How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. Series 9 is the current update for Horizon 5, which means that Series 10 is next. Now we already know a couple of little things about Series 10. We're going to make our predictions and clues off of the evidence that we have in today's video. If you do enjoy this video guys, please do consider subscribing. Let's get into it. So as I said, it is update 9, which means if we go to the festival playlist and go to the final coming soon tab, it tells us a bit of a teaser about Series 10. And it says on screen, Horizon X is apparently the theme name for Series 10, which will release on the 21st of July this year, obviously, which is actually only two days after Hot Wheels releases on the 19th of July. So it's kind of going to cross over almost exactly the same time for Series 10. We'll get a bit deep into Horizon X in a minute, but we can see that it's going to come with a new collectible, which I find very strange isn't plural collectible not collectibles new cars new challenges and new race branding now what could horizon x mean now i personally think horizon x is just a placeholder name horizon x means nothing that's my personal opinion because we know that x in roman numerals is 10 iphone 10 iphone x you know what i mean and it's series 10 so i think horizon x is just their way of not telling us the theme for this month and just putting series 10 as horizon x or horizon 10 do you get what i mean what's interesting though is we can look at the four symbols below we've got the new collectible which appears to have some kind of compass or map star thing not exactly exactly sure what that might mean but the one on new cars is a bit interesting we can see the new cars icon is a car with a, like a lightning bolt or electricity bolt next to it what does that mean well if you go to the festival playlist and go all the way to the end and have a look at the new forza ev rivals where it's a monthly rivals event in electric cars only i'm sure you've guessed where i'm going with this the symbol is exactly the same now does this mean that series 10 or the new cars we can see right here is it going to mean you know electric cars is this going to be an electric car update because the symbol is exactly the same as the forza monthly electric vehicle rivals that's my guess is what this could mean what electric vehicles we're getting we don't know is tesla returning we know that tesla is still in the game files are we getting the tesla are we getting very strange electric vehicles added to the game that just aren't very known i don't know we'll have to wait and see but electric vehicles are certainly a possibility new challenges we can't really guess anything to do with that that's probably just a generic new stuff new race branding sounds quite interesting though um and uh, no not really got any guesses as to what this could be however kelpie d over on gt planet i presume he maybe had a look into the files i'm not exactly sure where he got this information from but he said there's going to be four new types of races added within the new expansion on the 19th of july extreme circuit extreme street speed circuit and speed sprint now these are presumably race types within the hot wheels expansion and this might be what the new race branding is talking about sort of a new type of race now i don't know why they'd use the word branding but I can't really think of what else it would be. What does new race branding mean in Horizon terms? He said he found the icons in a RAR file, but the actual names for the circuits, not too sure. But either way, Extreme Circuit, Extreme Speed, Speed Circuit and Speed Sprint are the names of some race types we're getting in the new expansion, which is around Series 10. Now, I would usually leave it there. However, there is something else to talk about. As you've seen in my previous videos, sometimes when you change the language of your game and have a look at the Festival Playlist Coming Soon tab, it's sometimes different and gives you different pieces of information. Someone who is Spanish over on Twitter had a look at his Coming Soon tab and it's different. It doesn't say Horizon X, it says Extreme E. Everything else is the same. It says new cars, new collectible, new race branding, and everything like that. But as I said, what's different is it doesn't say Horizon X, which I believe was a placeholder name anyway. It says Extreme E. Now, I personally think this is sort of accidentally given away that the theme for Series 10 is going to be called Extreme E. Now, what is Extreme E, though? Well, if you Google Extreme E, I wasn't aware of this, but it, has, is it, a, it is actually an FIA-sanctioned international off-road racing series. 
which uses electric SUVs. So it adds up perfectly to this electrical symbol in the new cars being electric cars. Extreme E is electric SUVs. It's all adding up. I'm gonna pop a few screenshots on the screen right now of what type of cars are in the Extreme E sort of championship series, which is a real life thing. At this point, everything is adding up to this update being electric car related. Whether we're just going to get one electric car that is Extreme E series related and then the rest are going to be normal cars, we don't know. I'll be very surprised if they give us an update that's just electric cars, as some people really don't like them. So there's probably is going to be a bit of variety there, but the main theme of it is this. I did translate this guy's entire tweet just in case there was anything he said that I didn't notice. And as you can see, the translation on screen, uh, he didn't really say anything. He's just as confused as we are. But I want you guys to let me know in the comment section below if you've got a different language. So if, if you're not English and you're not Spanish, what language are you? in game and what does your festival playlist say does it say extreme e does it say horizon x does it say something different not too sure the only thing that does confuse me is i expected series 10 to have at least some relation to hot wheels hot wheels releases two days before this update and i just find it quite weird that they would bring out a hot wheels expansion and then have the next series the next bunch of new cars be electric SUVs. Seems quite weird. I would have thought they would added they would have a really good Series 10 update full of new sports cars, new hypercars, maybe even some more Hot Wheels vehicles, because it releases basically at the exact same time as the Hot Wheels does. So if they are to add any update that has lots of track toys and quick nippy vehicles to go around on Hot Wheels tracks, it's got to be update 10, surely. But it's not. It's going to be electric vehicles from what we can see because it might change. So it will be very interesting to see if this Extreme E changes to Horizon X or if Horizon X changes to Extreme E. Not entirely sure. This did happen last month because as you know, it said Horizon Academy, which later changed to Hot Wheels. Horizon Academy was just sort of a placeholder name for the new Horizon story, which ended up being within Hot Wheels. So either way, it's looking like Series 10 is going to be a good one. They've got some kind of theme behind it. Electric SUVs, electric cars seems to be the best guess. Let me know what you think in the comments section below. We can make a predicted guess that somewhere between the 7th and 14th of July, we will hear official news about what Series 10 is in a Forza Horizon 5 live stream. So make sure to subscribe so you don't miss the brief information on that. And also leave a like if you've enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't for more Horizon 5 content. Really butchered my outro then. I'll see you all later.